Arm It Girls. Hey there players, how's it going? Today I'm checking out a game called Armor Girls. Let's see if it's cool. So to get into it, I needed to click on the Japanese writing, so I left it in the video so you could see how I got into it without signing up through Facebook. Let's play. Oh Commander, so you are here. It's me, your Operator Ray. The war isn't going well. The base is surrounded by puppets that Def can't hold on too long. What should we do, Commander? Um, you mean that kid? Can we rely on her? She is still under test period. Hmm. I trust your judgement, Commander. She is already waiting at the bridge. Go receive her. Oh, hello, Commander. This is Neon Selene, the armor girl. Nice to meet you, sir. Um, being a test model, I have not been in the real war. But I will do my best for all of us. Do you want me to attack now, Commander? Let's do it. Armor girls are ready for deployment. Battle time. So, how should we attack? Please select this stage on the map. Okay, we'll select here. Easy. Oh yeah, here's our armor girl mission start. So how do we, have we got a joystick? We've got a joystick. Oh, we could have loved 2D games like this. Really cool looking character models. Uh, enemy. They are puppets. The aliens that intruded our world. Recall quick, recall what's in the training. I should have no problem. Okay, let's attack. So what can we do? Okay, Neo, your mission is to clear all the puppets in the zone ahead. The weapon will be overheated if used for long, and you have to wait for a long while before resuming it. Cooldown of weapons must be handled well to achieve optimal output. Alright, tap on weapon button. Take that. Can I keep... Oh, I just keep tapping and just shoot. Wicked. Oh, we better face the right way. I've also got a sub weapon, I'm going to try that out. So it's kind of a bit like Metal Slug, although you can walk up and down the screen. If found to be surrounded by puppets, ability is the most effective way to break through. Okay, is this sub weapon the ability? Ability will enter into cooldown after use. You have to wait for a while before resuming it. No problem, -os. let's do it. Tap on skill button to let launch a special attack. Ah, so we got four different things here. What's this one do? I'm not sure, I think it slowed it down. It's like most of them I can get without moving. Although these ones I'm going to have to turn around for. Take that. So we've got a countdown, we've only got 3 minutes and 20 seconds. Pity these guys keep talking to me. Handle it so quickly. Next Ray, destroy all enemies. Okay. Yeah, I dig on this guy. For a sub weapon. Ah. Uh, I think they got me a bit then, that sucked. Yeah, slow mo. I have succeeded. Fantastic. Protected everyone, finally. Mission complete. Victory, squad one, rank one, squad rank two. STA restored. Oh yeah, have luck. Clear the stage within 90 seconds. Well, because they kept talking to me. Task accomplished. Neo returns to squad. Is everyone okay? We own it to Neo, the new armor girl. So reliable. Life is spared, but still some bonus. These two issues should be considered differently. The retrieve rope is really powerful, and it helps us return to the ship from the ground in a short while. The rope is no big deal in comparison with our ship. Let's talk about next attack now, it also needs our help. The weapon retrieved earlier can be put into use now. Commander, please equip Neo in R&D room. Let's do that. You've received some new equipment. Oh yeah. Tap on the secondary weapon slot to equip your other weapon. Wicked, so we can fully change our weapons and equip stuff. This is a cool, fun game. All right, let's check out a bit of the next level. Commander, thanks for helping us resolve the problems. Are we going to war next? Yes, we sure are. Enter your name. Dude McShoot. 
There's the weapon equipped, just in time. Puppets are coming again. Please order to attack commander. Let's battle. All puppets detected, please get ready to deploy. Please select the difficulty. There was only one to select. Fight. Sweet, let's play some more Armor Girls. So yeah, I'm really digging this game and like, I haven't played many games quite like this, so it's unusual and it's cool how you can change your weapons and I'm sure there'll be some bosses. Oh, that was really rad. And yeah, just everything about it's quite original and fresh and yeah, really nice graphics, story seems okay. And yeah, my kind of game. Pretty hard to play one-handed though, because you need to turn around. Oh, they got me. Let's use my wicked attack. I'll take this evil spider robot. Yeah, yeah. So hopefully there's more than just spider robots. That's all I've seen so far. But I'm sure there's going to be heaps of different things to take on throughout the course of this game. Mega shot, take this. Oh, they're popping up from everywhere. They're surrounding me. I'm only level two. Alright, take that, they're all in a line. That's how you need them. Move on, five kill. Whoop. Press the wrong button. Take that. So yes, yeah, so I I think Armor Girls is a wicked game. I'm gonna give it four and a half stars. I'm just really digging it. And it's just so different from everything I've played recently and, and I'm into it. Ooh, shot the wrong way, that was pretty foolish. Oh, let's see if I can take out this boss. Shoot. Take that. Don't know if that's helping, hopefully it is. Yeah. Mega move. Take this. Whoop. I'm waiting for my cooldown. I need to get out of here. Ah. That health's pretty low too, though. Whoop. Take that. Mega move! Yeah, yeah! Got him! It was close but successful! Mission complete! So yeah, I reckon this game's cool. I'm giving it four and a half out of stars. If you like the look of it, grab it. It's free and it's cool. No ads or anything. Anyway, thanks for watching my first look at this game. I reckon I'll come back and play some more of this. Let me know if you want me to and catch you later. Bye!